You have probably heard how Pittsburgh is becoming a city of technology and innovation. Well, now the word is spreading to the White House and catching the attention of Ivanka Trump. See, she visited Astro Robotic Technology in the Strip District this afternoon and met with local robotics leaders. Legal editor Julie Grant is joining us with more. Julie. Susan and Stacy, when President Trump took office, he assigned his daughter and White House advisor Ivanka Trump to lead the efforts in developing our workforce. Young people may be what is most critical to that effort, which is why much of her visit today focused on some tech-savvy female students who were looking to use their engineering skills to change our future. Now, their name says it all. They are the Girls of Steel Robotics, these powerful, innovative young ladies from area high schools study robotics and compete on a team through a partnership with Carnegie Mellon University. They and Ms. Trump share the belief that it is critical for women to feel empowered in order to succeed in what has traditionally been a male-dominated field. The girls spoke to her about how valuable their STEM education has proven to be thus far. A big goal within American workforce development is aligning the skills learned in the classroom with the jobs in the country. Um, cities like Pittsburgh are experiencing a tremendous renaissance in large part because of young ladies and, um, and young men uh, uh, across the country who are at the forefront of that. So I'm really passionate about ensuring that workers of all ages, both students and, and mid to late career workers, have the skills that they need to thrive in the increasingly digital economy. Ms. Trump toured Astrobotic, learning all about the new technology that's used to explore outer space. The company flies hardware systems into space for companies, for governments, and for universities. And the highlight of the tour was perhaps walking through a mock-up of the International Space Station. She also got to test drive a robot that the Girls of Steel engineered. And we will show you that and more from my interview with her tonight at 10 and 11. For now, live in the studio, I'm Julie Grant, KDKA-TV News.